All right, good morning, good, good morning, morning from good morning. Santorini. I would say we're up bright and early, but we're not. It's no. like nine in the morning. Yeah, this is actually one of the latest days we've we've woken up since we've been here. <laughs> Very late start. <laughs> we, we, we've, had, we've had some early starts, but today is not. Not one of them, but Which today nice. we're going to take you guys out for a typical Greek breakfast. Yep. This was actually kind of hard to find, but we finally tracked down a restaurant that had Greek breakfast on yep. the menu. Yep. So yeah, we're going to go pick up your dad. Pumpy. Hopefully and he's then, awake. Uh, hopefully and he's then awake. Breakfast time. And we'll waddle off to the restaurant together. Let's do it. Doop, doop. Morning. There's home for the week. And Pumpy's ditching his glasses. He's like, I don't want to wear those. He can't wear the glasses on camera. Exactly. No, <laughs> no, he had to go back right. in. Oh, there he comes. There he comes. There he comes. There he comes. Do Fresh from the volcano water. He's all primped and quaffed and showered <laughs> and uh, hopefully hungry. Right? Oh, yeah, yeah. I oh, yeah. had a little bit of coffee this morning, so I'm all ready for the traditional Greek breakfast. Exactly. Excellent. Let's do this. Let's do this. Yeah. Alright, so we are starting breakfast. So my dad and I both ordered the exact same thing. We are getting the Greek breakfast and so far a few items have come. We both have orange juice as you can see over here. We've got a bread basket to share which looks awesome. We've got cake that we haven't tried yet and of course we have coffee. Greek coffee. Double, double Greek. Double coffee. Greek coffee and while he, while he was making it he asked how much sugar you want, and you asked for medium mm, sugar. So perfect. Oh, that's really good. Is it? I've Is never it? tasted anything like that before. Yeah. I also think it's super cool how they bring the coffee in this little thing. Oh yeah. It reminds me of Turkish coffee and Bosnian coffee. So you still have the the coffee grounds right at the bottom. So you're not supposed yep. to pour the whole thing into the cup. You have to leave a little bit. Yeah, yeah exactly. Super cool presentation. Makes so a good a good start to the breakfast. Do you want to yes. try the cake for us? Okay. You can just you can even just pick it up if you want. <laughs> no, I'll just I'll just use my fork here. Okay. Like a gentleman. Gen gentleman. Just take a little piece. Sure. It looks like it's got a, a little like chocolate rim. Ooh, and almonds. Inside. Ooh, almonds, almonds too. Almonds on top. Mm, Ooh. It's quite good. All right, time to try that orange juice. I, see. I, I believe it's freshly squeezed. It sure looks like it. it smells like real oranges. <laughs> smells like real oranges. <laughs> That's a good sign. <laughs> Is it good? Is it? It is really good. I mean, you know how many times you've had other orange juices? Yeah. Nothing like freshly squeezed orange I know. juice. No, me! I'm getting hungry over here. Okay. <laughs> it's my turn. So let's just go over and <laughs> dig right into yours. So what are you having? This is the hard part of filming, just sitting here quietly. Hey, okay. and I haven't even eaten yet. <laughs> <laughs> I got the, the Greek yogurt with walnuts and honey Look and we've walnuts. been having this as a dessert in a lot of restaurants here yeah. in Santorini and Athens yeah. too it's a really popular dessert and it's also what I've been eating at home for breakfast we yeah. bought some of the Greek yogurt yeah Although I've been adding granola Greek, Greek yogurt is so cheap to buy in the grocery store yeah. guys that is a great budget travel tip if you're here it's, yeah. real Greek. So good. it's really Greek it's sour and creamy and thick mm. how's that it's perfect is it perfect it's a perfect combination because the yogurt's a little bit sour. Yeah. And then you have the sweet honey drizzled all over. Really nice. And the nutty oh. flavor. And mm -hmm. the nutty flavor too. Mm. Yeah, I, the textures, the crunchiness. Dad, have, have you had a chance to try that on this trip? The, the Greek uh, yogurt with honey? And oh, I've, I've had Greek yogurt uh, every breakfast with my uh, cereal. So. Yeah, he have been buying his groceries. And we've had it with figs, with figs and honey as well. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's right. You can get creative with the toppings, but mm -hmm. the most typical is definitely walnuts with honey, mm -hmm. without a doubt. So good. So good. Mm -hmm. So, so good. And for my drink, I got some mountain tea. Yep. Not entirely sure what that means. Oh, it's fucked up the lens. So mountain tea. Mountain tea. From which mountains? We'll never know. <laughs> Actually, does it say on the on the tea bag? It says English breakfast. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> That's what they brought me for mountain So this is not very Greek. We have no. Greek coffee and English tea. <laughs> this mountain tea. <laughs> nice. We'll take what we can get at this Whatever. point. What's the highest point in the British Isles? <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Yeah, fill us in if you know that answer. <laughs> It's good tea. I can't See, complain. It's can't complain. Tea. Just not Greek. Not, not Greek. Greek. No. 
And I, I also didn't order a very Greek uh, beverage either. I've got a cappuccino. Cappuccino. So I will try that now. Breakfast is here, the strapazada. Yes. Strapazada. Before I even try that, I'm going to try my cappuccino. All right. Which is probably getting cold. Need a little bit of caffeine, a little boost. Oh, that's good. It has a really nice um, frothy white at the top. Oh. And I had probably had my worst cappuccino ever yesterday at this... Uh, there's a hole in the wall, please. In the old port? They served me instant, yeah, it was a really bad. They served me instant coffee for my cappuccino, so it's nice to have a real one. It was outside the natural definition of cappuccino. Yeah, so. I'd say. It wasn't even close. It wasn't even close. Okay, and so what I'm having for, as part of my Greek breakfast as well, this is also, also my dad has this too. Strapazada. Strapazada. So you can see it has feta cheese in here, it has Ooh. tomato, and of course it has egg. Wow. So it looks that looks wonderful, and I think there's been some cracked pepper um, put, it looks like put on top too. Scrambled eggs, but like oh. mixed really well. Oh my gosh! That's, How is that? That's like next level scrambled eggs with the feta. Wow! I'm wishing I'd gone for something savory. Oh my now. gosh, that's so good. Half the feta, half. the feta just gives it like that extra saltiness and the richness of of having the, the cheesy feta in there, and then to have the the egg and and the juiciness of the tomato kind of complements that that saltiness. It gives it a little bit. Of wow. sweetness and juiciness. I find that delicious. And it's also come with a nice little side salad too. And the only thing left for me to try now is the bread. The I bread. Tried the homemade bread. Oh, I already like have a piece there, I forgot. Artisanal bread. Look at that. Look, look at all the options I have. There's different jams, different marmalades, there's honey, there's butter. So I'm not gonna take all the time to spread it. I'm just gonna try the bread. Just spread. Bread, the bread on for its own. now. Mm -hmm. Oh it's crunchy. Sounds yeah, it's super crunchy. Definitely homemade. Really good quality bread. So far, this breakfast has just been outstanding. So nice to try. I've never tried this this this, mm -hmm. this before. So this is completely new to me. This looks amazing. Um, Everything. It's just been a great, great start to breakfast. And um, yeah, now we just gotta put a big, uh, big Dig dent in it. it. Dig, Dig in. in. <laughs> All right, Audrey, you're gonna try. This is your first time. I, too. I got a little bit of the eggs from yeah. Sam and George. It just yeah. looked so tempting. We're at the sharing is carrying stage. We sure are. <laughs> we split it all up. We gave we gave Dad some Greek yogurt too, mm. <laughs> and me as well. That's just wonderful. I think that's my favorite thing on the table right now. Yeah. The tomatoes and the feta mixed together. Kind of reminds me a bit wow. of shakshuka a little bit too. Yeah, like it's somewhere between shakshuka and scrambled eggs. Yeah. And an omelet. Yeah, exactly. It's just like a combination of those. Yeah. So, so what, do you, put it on what do you think of breakfast so far, Dad? Enjoying it? It's amazing. It's amazing, isn't it? I, I love the... Um, the diversity of it? Yeah, I love the diversity of it. And, and uh, it's just it's an awesome good. breakfast. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Have you tried the Greek yogurt yet? Mm, I have. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll take one more. I'll try one more. I love I love all the ingredients. Here, I know, so. Walnuts, honey, Greek yogurt. Mm. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> Tasty. Awesome. <laughs> it's awesome, awesome, eh? Price point for breakfast. <sighs> well, first I've got to mention that we're all really full. That was a very big breakfast, and we were all just like discussing amongst ourselves. That was the best breakfast that we had on this entire Europe trip. We've kind of generally been eating at, at home usually, mm -hmm. and that was to go out and have a really gourmet breakfast like this. Like to have all those different items, like the Greek yogurt, the bread, the egg dish. Just all the nice coffees and drinks. It was just outstanding. Absolutely outstanding. The other thing that we really liked too was the setting here. There's mm -hmm. a nice garden setting. And then there's another section where there's an open terrace, which is where we were. Yeah. And then you can also go inside. There's also uh, an option to dine indoors as well. And in terms of the price point, that came to 33 euros for the three of us. So it wasn't like a super cheap breakfast, but you know, we are on, uh, we are on Santorini. So prices are a little higher. But in terms of the quality of the food, everything was outstanding. And if you're, if you're visiting here, especially if you're staying in Fear and you're looking for a place to have a really nice breakfast or brunch, highly recommend coming here. It was just outstanding. So we will see you guys in the next food video. Ta-ta for now. And there were two things I forgot to mention about this place that, that you pointed out yes. off camera. The uh, freshly squeezed orange juice was outstanding. Yeah. And the soft jazz music in the background. It was like, it just makes you just, sink back in your chair and... It almost Relax. makes you want to sleep. You almost want to sleep after yeah. breakfast. So anyways, this It'll is put the... you in a really mellow mood for the whole day. <laughs> exactly. It's a great way to start the day. So this is the final ta-ta. Ta-ta? Ta-ta, guys. Mm -hmm.